Consumption makes up more than two-thirds of the U.S. economy today, and most shopping is done by women. So if you want to know what's happening in the U.S. economy, ask a woman, which is what we did. We spoke with six female business owners in Lower Hudson Valley to get their views on the economy, both of small business owners and women. Here's what they had to say. Okay, we started Sign of the Times 23 years ago. I have a partner, Denise Cohen. My name is Leandra Vasquez. I provide flowers for weddings and special events. I have been in business for 24 years in Naya. My uh, background is in the fashion design industry where I studied and opened up the shop. I'm in the hair salon business and we specialize in color and uh, I've been here for 20 years. The shop uh, was geared to fashion savvy women and men. We opened up 18 months ago in a different location. We've only been here for a few weeks. But we got into it because I loved shop consignment shopping. Grand view. It's worth a trip from anywhere. Our reason for being is to dare to be different from a major department store. We have found that Nyack is experiencing a downturn with foot traffic. The 2008 downturn was different than previous cycles in that it impacted the financial industry, real estate, and households. The resulting downturn impacted small businesses in a way that hasn't been seen for decades. After the the recession in 2008, this affected everyone, and it was very frightening. I've never seen a downturn like this. This is the first time it's actually affected our business. We just see it, people coming in, and it's, it's just this whole mindset about spending money. People are, are stressed. A lot of people assume that because Nyack's an affluent area, it will be shielded from the worst of the downturn. Our same customer base was not coming in on the same regular basis. And when they were shopping, they were shopping last. Two businesses we spoke with don't fit the traditional mold of the retail store. How are they different? And what can we learn from them? It's different than opening up a regular store. A regular store, there's a lot you have to invest in your inventory. Or it's an event that's a one of event. It's not an everyday, so people may splurge on this one day. All the women we spoke with have some internet presence, which is critical. It's there 24 hours a day, seven days a week. We exist in every village, every town, every city, every state in the country. We are what made this country. We're your problem solvers. We really are. That's what we like to do. You know, women in businesses, small business and business, are really the lifeblood of our economy. If we don't support local, we're never going to get to that global. For women, business is personal. It's about cultivating a long-term relationship. And over time, customers often become friends. Mm -hmm.